Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Grand Auto 5 Mods video. Today we're going to be playing as firefighters with the Los Santos Fire Department. We are back with rescue number 7. We used this thing last time. This truck is amazing. We responded to a bunch of motor vehicle accidents and flipped over cars. We had to use the jaws of life. It was crazy. Now today I want to show you another rescue call that comes with fire callouts. This one is an industrial accident. It's pretty cool. Um, sir, are you okay? Let me help you out. I just, I didn't mean to pick him up this way. <laughs> oh my god, alright sir, you go ahead and have yourself a good day, alright? You're welcome. But yeah, we're going to be using rescue number 7. This thing is amazing, guys, and we'll be checking out the industrial accident call from Fire Callout. So, let's go ahead and get this one started. Alright, industrial accident, rescue is res needed, respond, okay, we are on our way. Once we get onto the scene, we gotta talk to the caller, okay. Cloudy day today in the city. Wait a minute, there's a firehouse right over here. I wonder if they're responding to or not. Maybe they're on another call. I think it's going to be up here at this oil field site. I wonder what could have happened. Maybe pipe fell on somebody? Maybe somebody fell in an oil well? That would be crazy. Imagine trying to pull somebody out of an oil well. That would be insane. gonna be on scene what in the world happened all right let's take a look at the situation all right so we got to talk to the caller I think it's this guy over here let's see what he says Yes, I did. This debris just dropped on top of him. He is hurt pretty bad. Please help. Okay, we will do our best here. So it looks like he got a log and a couple metal pipes through him. Oh my god, he's impaled. Oh man, that's in a terrible spot. Alright, let's see what we can do here. I'm gonna try to stabilize his neck first. Okay. All right, victim is secured. We can now start the extrication. Okay. Well, we're going with the K-12 for this one, guys. All right. Um, let me get this tree out of the way first, this log. So we'll start cutting this. Oh, okay. There we go. Right, now he got two uh, pipes and um, I think the bottom one may not be in it. I think it's just this one here, so. OK, 
Okay, we got that. I don't think that one's in him, so let's put this away. Grab the medical bag. Uh, let's see if we can start treating him. Alright, we're going to do a quick injury assessment on him. Dispatch, we're going to need EMS to our location on a rush. Alright, he has a broken leg, splint bandage, and painkillers. Okay. Alright, so right now we're just trying to get him stabilized so that by the time the ambulance gets here, he is ready to go. Okay. Alright, he is stable. Alright, perfect. You're looking good, buddy. You're looking good. Alright, let's get you to the hospital. That sounds like the ambulance is arriving on scene. We'll go ahead and put that back. Park so far away. <laughs> Hopefully they could get in here. I guess we can probably take take him to them maybe. Oh, here they come. Perfect. All right. Yeah, I got you out stretcher. All right. So he was impaled from this pipe. I cut around the pipe. It's still in there, but he's stabilized. So get him to the trauma center, and they should be able to treat him. Hopefully he'll be okay. All right, well, uh, we're going to be back in service with that one, guys. EMS is going to go ahead and do their thing. And then it's up to the doctors. Damn, just started pouring out of nowhere. Oh, man. Just got to get out of there. I knew it was going to rain today when I saw those clouds earlier. I'm like, yep, it's going to be pouring. But yeah, guys, let me know how are you guys doing. You guys having a good day? I hope all is well. As always, thank you guys for checking out today's video. I really do hope you guys enjoy it. I feel like this is a good spot to like flip over a semi truck. I think I'm going to do that. <laughs> Not on purpose, of course, but we need to do some more ace towing. So I feel like that's a good spot to crash a truck and it will send Ace Towing out here to see if they can rescue them. Okay, we are back at the firehouse. got another call. Looks like somebody crashed their vehicle, probably because of this rain. Goodness, this is a big one here. All right, let's stop traffic. Well, one guy got ejected. He's on top of this car. Wow. All right, let's get to work. Let's start with these struts. 
I want to stabilize this vehicle up here, make sure that does not fall down while we're working. Alright, we got that in. Let's grab our gear. This is a crazy exit. I can't believe there's a car on top of another car. Alright, let's get the generator going. Let's see if I can get this, uh, yeah, let's go with this one real quick, let's get her out. Get these opened up. Uh, let's start cutting. This car is actually rocking a little bit. I think the stabilizers are technically on the other car. Yeah, let's see if we can get this door open. Oh, we're not cutting the trunk. Alright, I think I should move these struts. Yeah, let's um, let's do the smart thing, guys. Let's pick up these struts and let's move them. And let me try to better stabilize this one that's on top. Okay, so now that should stop moving, and now we have a much safer work environment for both us and the patients. Alright, now we should be able to cut her out a little bit better. Everything opened up. We're gonna need an EMS now. Start working on everybody here. We are still waiting for EMS to get here. This is a crazy scene, though. It was really cool since that vehicle ended up on top of that one. It really gave us a reason to use the stabilizer struts. Because you guys saw how it was shaking and it could have fell on us, so putting on the struts helped keep us safe. I love how my guys are just, oh, we're sitting inside, nice and warm inside the rescue, nice and dry. <laughs> All 
Alright, everybody's looking good. It's getting a mess out here. I gotta need. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to pick up both of them at the same time. It looks like EMS is working on transporting everybody over there. We're gonna have to get Ace Towing out here to start towing these vehicles. Oh, wow, that one just disappeared, okay. Guess we'll call one for this one. And we'll call a flatbed for that one. Alright, tow trucks are here, ambulance is about to clear, and we're about to clear as well. Alright guys, well that is going to do it for today's episode. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure you go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. Subscribe if you are new. Also hit that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we post a new video, guys. And again, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you guys thought about the episode. And do you guys want to see some more of this pack? We still haven't used the hazmat yet. So I got to try to find a good call so that we can use the hazmat. And I think there was two more ladders we didn't use yet either in this pack. So let me know what you guys want to see. If you want to download this mod or learn how to do this, make sure you guys check out my website, acepilot2k7.com. I have links to all of the mods that I use on my website. I also have tutorials to help you install them as well. Also, if you would like to check out some of my extra videos on my website, consider becoming a subscriber. You get to see my behind the scenes videos and see how I set all this stuff up. I also have some first access videos that are uploaded on my website that are only on my website. So you get to watch some exclusive videos that no one else gets to see on YouTube. And if you want to get some merchandise, you can get some merchandise on my website as well. Again, it is acepilot2k7.com. Link is in the video description. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.